My name is Sam Howard Spink. I'm a clinical assistant professor of music business in Steinhardt in the Department of Music and Performing Arts Professions. Something that we take very seriously in the music business program is the entrepreneurial approach that is an aspect of everything that we do. So we don't think of ourselves as a place where we have students come through a program and then they just get placed in the existing music business. We want students to be able to think about how the music business is changing while they're in it and to behave entrepreneurially within it. Something we say is if you're coming here for the four-year degree, the music business that exists when you arrive will be quite different from the music business that exists by the time you leave. And so just learning specifics of how things work isn't enough. It's learning about how things change and being able to adapt to change and being able to anticipate change. And that's something that we spend a lot of time talking to the students about. The best way to think about the music business program is to think of it as existing in five core areas. The first one is the core liberal arts classes that everybody that comes into Steinhardt takes. Then everybody that comes into the Department of Music and Performing Arts Professions takes a core set of music classes. This is very unusual for a music business program to have an emphasis like this on actually maintaining musical talent or your, your musical chops over the course of the four years that you're here. The third area is the music business specialization classes themselves which are taught by dedicated faculty that deal with certain specific areas of the business. We have concert management class, we have a music publishing class, we have a strategic branding class. All of these things combine together to give you a, a, a wide range of, uh, of exposure to the various different aspects of the music business. Among the other music specializations we have is Village Records. This is a very special course. It's very student-led. It's an in-house recording label and promotions company. And every semester, the students choose an act or an artist that they want to work with. They work with them on, on publishing, on producing a recording, and then on marketing that recording itself. Whatever the students come up with as ideas for ways to work to promote this artist, uh, we will find ways to help them facilitate that. The fourth area is the classes that the students will take at the Stern School of Business. You'll take in classes in a serious business school, they will give you a core grounding in business studies that you will be able to use and take with you wherever you go. And the fifth area is the internships. We have a deep, long-running internship program uh, with uh, hundreds of opportunities and new opportunities every day for students to work with different kinds of companies. You can take numerous internship credits, so we encourage people to take them at a couple of different places so you can find out if you're more comfortable working in a large-scale organization like a corporation or a smaller scale like a, a smaller music company, a small label, a small startup, maybe a tech a startup of some kind. And it's also possible to form the kind of relationships in those companies which allow you to go into working for them as you graduate out from the program itself. One of the strongest elements of the degree altogether is it gives you um, exposure to so many different parts of uh, academia and music and music business as well that you become somebody who's specialized in communicating across those different groups. So whether you need to speak to a producer or a director or a marketer or an artist or a technologist, you will be one of those people that will be able to communicate across those different groups. One of the advantages of being in New York City is having the range of people that come through the city, whether they're coming from the north, south, east, or west, they will come through New York. So you can have famous musicians, you can have famous music business people, you can have different kinds of technologists or people working for different kinds of music startups. They all have some reason to be in New York City, and we have a way to bring them in to meet the students. An important aspect of the program is its international focus. Uh, there are classes dedicated to uh, looking at the international music business. And so we uh, not only encourage studying uh, the global aspects of the business, but also we encourage our students to take a, a semester abroad. We can place students in any of the cities where NYU has a site. Something that we've done more recently is actually coordinate a project between the students at the various different international sites. So they work online together to produce a coherent project about their different experiences to help them build out a picture of global music. Everybody knows that the music business or the media business in general is very strong on, on, on networking. So the very first network that you're gonna have will be your cohort of music business students. Students. Every year we accept about 40 students. They will begin as your first music business network. 
then for every guest that we bring in, every new former student that you meet, every alumni that you meet, everybody from a different year, and then the people coming in underneath you as you move through the program, all of these people will be your music network. This is exactly how people progress through the business or how they get their, their start in it. There's more music business now than there's ever been. There may be fewer CDs sold, but there's more music being sold than there's ever been. There's more music being exploited in more places than there's ever been. There's more people making livings from their musical uh, activities than has ever been possible. We spend a lot of time preparing our students for a, a, a fast-paced, fast-changing uh, media and business environment.